Hi, boys and girls. Today is Friday, and we're going to do a writing activity today. Uh, I thought I might let it pertain a little bit to science since we didn't do our science experiment this week. So I figured we'd talk about dinosaurs because that's one of my favorite subjects. And we're going to write the word extinct and fossil. Those are big words, boys and girls. And I hope you're up, up to the task of trying to write them. But don't, you don't have to worry about it. It don't have to be perfect. I just want you to know what they are and what they look like and what they mean. Okay, so let's get our journal. It's that green book. Let's turn it to a nice, clean page. And first of all, since we know that dinosaurs do not exist anymore, we're going to write the word extinct. C-T. Extinct. E X. T-I-N-C-T. Extinct. And that means they're gone forever, boys and girls. That word means gone forever. Not, not, nobody will ever see a live dinosaur ever again. They're extinct. And how do we know they existed? If they're, if they're gone forever, how do we know that they existed? Because paleontologists are finding Fossils, and a paleontologist is somebody who digs in the earth and finds um, uh, old things. A paleontologist finds dinosaur bones. F-O-S-S-I-L, fossil. That's how we know that dinosaurs existed because paleontologists are finding fossils. Fossils, extinct and fossil. That's how we know. That's how we know they existed. They are digging for fossils. Paleontologist. I'm not going to ask you to write that word because Miss Caps probably couldn't even spell that one. That one is a big word. We know they existed because of fossils and dig. It's an archaeological dig. Archaeologists are, are scientists that dig in the earth. And they, and paleontologists dig for fossils. Paleontologists are scientists that dig for fossils. Dig. D-I-G. Dig in the earth. So extinct, fossil, and dig. That's how we know they existed because they're extinct. They're gone forever. Dinosaurs. We can talk about dinosaurs all day. Carnivore, C-A-R-N-O-V-O-R. Carnivore. That means eating meat, a meat eater. Carnivore, a meat eater. A meat eater. Carnivore, that's an A, C-A-R-N-A-V-O-R, -A -A carnivore, that means they eat meat. Herbivore means they eat only plants. Carnivore is, would be the, an example of that would be a T-Rex. T-Rex, Tyrannosaurus Rex, you can spell it T-Rex. All right, boys and girls, I hope you have a great weekend and enjoy practicing your writing. Even if you can't write all the words, it's okay. Just practice. Practice letters. That's all I want you to do. I love you, boys and girls. See you again soon.